Hey guys, it's Madam Wario. Welcome to my January 2019 update. I hope you guys have been having a fantastic start to your 2019, that you've had a fabulous new year. And I want to just dive right in by addressing why I took a hiatus at the very end of last year. A lot of you know who have been following me on social media or who have been attending my Twitch streams, but I took a hiatus between Thanksgiving and the new year because I suffered two deaths in my family. My grandfather passed away, who is probably the closest grandparent I've ever had as a relative. I was extremely close to him. It really just broke my heart. And then 10 days later, I actually lost Hamo. I lost my beloved hamster I just adopted in August. And I was so heartbroken. It was so unexpected. It was just a horrible, horrible way to start the holiday season. And I just was so emotional. I couldn't stop crying. It was an awful, awful time that I just, I want to be real with you guys. And I, I want to just put myself out there, but I just felt like I wasn't ready to do that at that time. So that's why I stepped away from streaming. I stepped away from posting videos and I just kind of took a break. So I want to thank you guys for your patience with that and your understanding. It was a very difficult time and Rest in peace to both my grandpa and Hamo. I love both of them and miss them so much. It's still a struggle today. So stepping away from last year and talking about my plans for this year, I would like to start out by introducing you guys to something I am extremely excited and extremely nervous about. This has been a long time coming, but I finally have a website. MadamWario.com is a real life thing. It is public, it's been published, and I'm so excited to start this vlogging journey with you guys. I plan to post all kinds of gaming content, free crochet tutorials, all kinds of dance and lifestyle content, just pretty much anything I'm passionate about, I plan to write about on the website or make fun posts for you guys. And you can comment, you can interact, I want this to be like a safe hub for all of us to just be awesome nerds and embrace our nerdiness with. So please visit the site. I've got a few posts up already, including a free crochet tutorial. It's a Tamagotchi Amigurumi tutorial, so that's super fun. I have my famous chocolate chip cookie recipe on there, and I also have a post about the start of this year and what I plan to do with my website so you guys can get more of a feel for what my goals are on there. But please visit the site. I'm so excited about it. And I want to thank every single one of you who donated to make the website a possibility over a year ago. It's taken me this long to kind of hunker down and be like, I'm going to learn how to make a website and make it exactly what I want it to be. So please visit the link in the video description or you can just go to madamwario.com if that's easier for you. But please visit the site. I would love to hear your thoughts. So thank you guys so, so much for making that a reality. And in addition to that, I want to talk about my streaming schedule for the year as I have already begun streaming this year. And my schedule is exactly the same as last year. So it's going to be Tuesdays and Fridays at 8 p.m. Eastern time. So you can catch me on Tuesdays and Fridays at twitch.tv slash madamwario. Again, it's 8 p.m. both days Eastern time. And what I plan to produce on there is kind of the same as last year, and it's just kind of a rollover from last year. Fridays, I always play Mario Party. We're currently playing Mario Party 6, and that will transition into Mario Party 7 once that's done, and then Mario Party 8, and so on. And then Tuesday is kind of reserved for me playing any game I feel like playing. A lot of the time it is Mario Party as well, but sometimes it's different. That's kind of my free day to just play whatever game I'm in the mood for. But it's super fun, streams are always so much fun, and they're always archived on YouTube for if you miss them, so don't feel bad if you can't make it or anything like that. They'll always be available on YouTube, but of course, I love being able to interact with you guys live. So again, Tuesdays and Fridays at 8 p.m. Eastern Time is my stream schedule. In addition to that, um, I have been doing a few pop-up streams lately, and what that means is this is an unscheduled stream. If it's a pop-up stream, it was not scheduled or anything, it's just kind of me tweeting and saying, I'm going live, and then it happens. So keep an eye out for those. Um, I have been participating in Mario Party speedrunning as of AGDQ. I was inspired to start speedrunning Mario Party, and I found out that you can speedrun Minigame Island in Mario Party, and so I tried my first attempt. It was terrible, and so you can expect more pop-up attempts of that, as well as some Kingdom Hearts content. I have been streaming random Kingdom Hearts content in preparation for Kingdom Hearts 3, 
And so that's something you can also expect to see on my Twitch channel from time to time. So that's what's been going on on Twitch. And now I want to talk about what I plan to happen on YouTube. Starting tomorrow, Monday, January 21st, I will be starting a brand new casual LP. Now when I say casual, I mean it's not going to have a schedule, it's not going to have a set, you know, upload schedule or upload time or any of that. It's just going to kind of come throughout the year as, as is necessary. So I am going to start a casual LP of Toontown Rewritten. I have done streams of Toontown Rewritten in the past. But I really wanted to make a video tutorial of how to play the game, how to get started with the game, what everything means. So I literally recorded an hour and a half long video that is an introduction to Toontown and shows everything you need to know at the start of the game. And it is an MMO. This can literally take years to beat. So it's not going to be like a regular LP. I'm not going to show you everything in the game or every step of the way to my character getting to the end. And I might not even use the same character the whole time as that will make things a lot more difficult. So it's just something I plan to make videos on and have focused videos on a certain topic in the game or how to do this or certain, you know, items in the game or things like that. I don't plan to just follow the character in every single task along the way and see what happens because, again, that would literally take years um, unless I only did that nonstop and did absolutely nothing else, which is unreasonable and not going to happen. So. But anyway, I'm excited to start that, so you can expect the beginning of Let's Play Toontown rewritten on my channel tomorrow, Monday, January 21st, 2019. So I'm very excited about that. In addition, my channel anniversary is coming up on January 29th, 2019. It is my nine year channel anniversary. I can't believe it's been nine years and I'm so excited to celebrate with you guys. As always, I will have an anniversary special here on my channel. And then it's also a Tuesday, so I will be streaming that night at eight o'clock Eastern time. I will be streaming Mario Party, the original, because it was my first LP and it is my favorite game in the entire world, so. That's what you can expect on my channel anniversary, and I ask a favor of you guys, if you could leave a comment on this video of your favorite moment from my past nine years on YouTube, or something, a story, or anything that you think of that you would like maybe featured in that anniversary special, I would love to feature some of your comments. So please comment a favorite moment or anything like that. Thank you guys so much for all your support throughout the years. It's been amazing, and I love you guys so, so much, so thank you for everything. I look forward to my ninth anniversary, and I look forward to many more years of content online. So moving on to other aspects of my online life, I would like to discuss my Etsy shop because this year I have decided I want to give back. I've been so inspired by some of the companies that I buy from regularly now because they are give back companies and what that means is that a percentage of their profits is donated to an organization for the greater good. And most of them are animal organizations as I am a huge animal lover and I would like to do the same. So I've decided that 10% of all my Etsy profits from this year are going to be donated to Best Friends. Friends Animal Society. It's one of my favorite animal organizations in the entire world and it has upped the percentage of no-kill shelters in the U.S. by 91% in the past few years, which is amazing. They want to make all animal shelters no-kill by 2025 and they are on their way to reaching that goal. So I really want to support that. I want to donate a percentage of the money I make to them so that they can reach that goal and that we can have animal welfare be something that is very prominent in our society. And I want to make sure that I am just on board with that all the way. So anything you purchase from my Etsy store this year, 10% of the profit is going to go to Best Friends Animal Society. And I would like that to continue on. So that's kind of my goal. I also plan to have a shopping stream where you can shop with Madam, where I will be showing off some of my merchandise as I have had some of the same merchandise for several years now and I would love to, you know, 
be able to adopt off all the old merchandise so that I can make room for the new merchandise I'm currently working on. So I think it'd be fun to have a shopping stream with you guys. And there will be more information about that in the future. I'm going to make its own video just kind of explaining that and what day it's going to be. But know that that's coming up. I will be doing a shopping with Madam stream where I'll be showing off each piece of merchandise in my store and you can you guys can purchase it with a discount and it's just going to be a, a super fun event so I'm looking forward to that. In addition, um, I want to go over my Patreon schedule. For those of you who don't know, I do have a Patreon page. Patreon is a subscription-based website where you can pledge the dollar amount you want to subscribe to every month. For example, if you wanted to pledge to my Patreon, that would mean that you would be donating at least one dollar a month to my channel or my online content, and then you get little rewards and fun features for doing so. So I have a lot of content that goes up on my channel related to Patreon that comes from uh, that outlet. So if you guys are interested, please visit my Patreon page. It's in the video description. So I've actually got several of those videos coming this week for the month of January. Some are already up, uh, but you can expect the rest this week. In other news, I have my convention plans for 2019. I plan to attend three conventions this year, and one is coming up very soon. The first is going to be Anime Crossroads in Indianapolis, Indiana. It is the weekend of February 8th through the 10th. So that's going to be the first convention that I am attending this year. I plan to participate in the Cosplay Masquerade. It's a pretty local convention for me, so I try to go whenever it's possible, and I will be in attendance with my sister, Madam Toadstool, this year. So if you plan to be at that convention, feel free to tweet at us, say hi, come up if you see us, you know, all that good stuff. I will also be attending MomoCon in Atlanta, Georgia this May. It runs from May 23rd through the 26th. And this is my first MomoCon ever, so I'm super excited. I know it's very cosplay centralized, so that really gets me excited. And I'm going with my huge group of friends that typically goes to MAGFest. We didn't do MAGFest this year because it's kind of gotten crazy and out of hand and difficult to get hotel space for all of us. So we decided to do MomoCon this year. And again, it's my, my very first MomoCon ever, and I think it's most of our first MomoCon. So that's an experience I'm very much looking forward to, super excited about. Again, it's not till May, so you'll probably see another update, you know, obviously closer to the actual convention time. And then I'm also planning to attend Con Bravo in Hamilton, Ontario, Canada in July 2019 as well. I don't believe the dates have been announced for that, but it's usually the last weekend in July, so that's just kind of what I'm anticipating. But those are the three cons I plan to attend this year. I'm very excited, so Anime Crossroads in February, MomoCon in May, and Con Bravo in July. So if you're going to be at any of those conventions, I also plan to be in attendance, and I would love to meet any of you guys that are there, so feel free to come up and say hi. I love meeting you guys, and it's always an awesome experience. So lastly, the last thing I want to cover in this update that, as usual, has gone on for too long, but it was necessary. I mean, I had a lot to tell you guys about, but I want to introduce somebody. I want to introduce the newest member of my family. And the newest member of my family is none other than Queen, my newest hamster. I did adopt another hamster after Hamel passed away. I wanted to adopt another hamster in honor of her and give another hamster the opportunity at a great life. You know, I wanted to try again. I wanted to be sure to give an animal the best life it could receive uh, in my hands. And so I adopted Queen. He's a very vocal boy. He is extremely shy. He is the opposite of Hamo entirely. And he, he screams at me kind of all the time. I don't even do anything. I just go up and talk to him and he's, he starts squealing and going, rah, rah, making the weirdest noises I've ever heard. So. He's an interesting boy. He is a very different boy. He's very shy, um, and yes, his name is Queen, after the beloved rock band that I absolutely adore, Queen. Plus, the irony of the fact that Hamo will forever be my little girl, but I think she was actually a boy. So I was like, oh, okay, well, this makes sense. He actually is a boy, so I'll name him Queen, so it's perfect. Welcome, Queen. We adore you, even though you don't really adore us that much. So, love you, Queen. And that is all for my January update for 2019. I don't know when I'll have um, another generalized update like this. I usually do this 
quarterly so you might see another one in the spring but other than that keep an eye out for my shopping stream announcement where I will give the date and the information for that please visit all the links in my video description as they are everything I talked about in this update please visit my website I would love to get your feedback and your thoughts and don't forget to leave a comment of your favorite moment from the past nine years I've been on YouTube so that you can maybe get featured in my anniversary special coming on the 29th of this month. I love you pimps so much. Thank you for all your support to my channel and for constantly being involved with me and sending me nice comments and tweets and interacting with me. Just know that your comments don't go unnoticed. Even if I don't respond to them, I read all of them and I love you guys so much for spending your time with me. So you are awesome, fierce, and fabulous pimps. I give all of you a bah for 2019. And I will see you probably on my next stream or in my next video. So love you guys so much. Take care and peace out, pimps.